uh, really with having a bigger influence on your career than anybody and have said that he's helped you in ways that people could never understand. How so? Well, I think that Michael has always been like a, a brother to me. Michael is a great businessman. If you go back and look at it, Michael was probably the first jock businessman. He talked me, taught me about stock options, you know, because I was making a nice chunk of change from Nike. And he saw that. And, and he says, stop taking so much cash, take stock options. And if I remember correctly, I think I quadrupled my money. Uh, but he's been a great mentor to me in the business world, and he's been a great friend. What, what's caused the rift between y you and Michael? I think that Michael uh, was upset about some of the things I said about the Bobcats, which, number one, they were true. I can't, you know, I told you earlier, I'm going to be honest and I'm going to be fair. And the Bobcats, first of all, he's doing a much better job. But, uh, you know, a couple years ago, I want to say three years ago, when they were vying for the worst record in NBA history, uh, Michael had not done a good job. Yeah. Uh, and he, ta he, takes, he took it personally. Well, I mean, if you guys have been great friends forever, why should that matter in the grand scheme of things if you just criticize I think the, that, some man, I NBA think that, decisions? I think that everybody got I, – I, I wish it was that simple, to be honest with you. Uh, but I always love him like a brother. But I'm going to do my job, first and foremost. Because I can't get on TV and be dishonest with people. They know when you're being dishonest and disingenuous. Uh, I'm going to do my job, plain and simple. You think the rift's able to be repaired? Always. Okay. Always. Uh, so 93 NBA Finals, yeah. your son stunned the Bulls uh, to bring